everyone welcome to this playlist in this video we are going to discuss more tricky c programming mcqs so let's start what will be the output of this program friends try to solve this question first these are the options I am using online JDB compiler. So let's see what is the output of this code. See here nothing going to be printed because blank for loop with semicolon is always act as an infinite loop. So printf will never going to be printed. So it is act as like a while loop so answer is nothing is printed next questions friends try to this question these are the options see what is the output of this code let's run the code see output is a like compiler error why compiler error because for loop should have semicolon not comma in this for loop using comma instead of semicolon so it produced compiler error if you use here semicolon then it will going to print five time high one two three four five okay so answer is compiler error moving to the next questions Friends, see the code and try to solve first. These are the options. What is the output of this code? Paste. Run. Output is funda. How funda? Here, integer x is equal to 0 first x assign 0 then in also if uses assignment operator is equal to x is equal to 0 so now assign x is 0 so if 0 always become false so it will going to print is a else part if you want to get output as a coder then you need to declare here double equal to so let's see the output is coder okay so answer is funda next questions which is the not valid variable name in c so you can see the options so answer is integer do so variable name may be start with underscore also so this option is valid this option also valid this option also valid break is our like local variable name so it is also valid but do is not a local variable do is a keyword of c programming language so this is not valid variable name it will generate compiler error if you use in a code so here you can see keywords in c programming language there are 32 keywords is there so here you can see the difference between this break and this break okay this will take like local variable and this is a uh, keywords of c programming okay here do is our keyword of c programming next question what will be the output of this program try to solve this question friends first these are the options available let's see the output of this code is 2 so how to we uh, we are going to solve this question priority wise okay so first it will solved by doing addition so in this operators addition is a higher priority so c1 pro plus 2 c1 pro is 3 so 3 plus 2 so then it will 5 then after if we see in the priority wise less than is a higher priority so c pro less than 5 4 less than 5 it means it's a true so it will take as a 1 so after that 
not equal to is a higher priority. So C1 pro not equal to C2 pro 3 not equal to 1. So it is also going to be true. So 1 is equal to equal to 1. So it is also going to be true. So 1. So now C2 pro plus equal to 1. It means if we expand this equation C2 pro is equal to C2 pro plus 1. So 1 plus 1. So it will going to be print 2. So answer is that's why 2. So answer is 2. Okay. So thank you so much friends watching this video. And uh, if you have any doubt then feel free to ask me in comment section also. Uh, see you soon in the next video. Bye bye.